Turkey has a developed defense industry and has produced a wide range of military equipment, including ammunition. Turkey's defense industry has produced various types of weapon systems and ammunition, which are often exhibited at international defense exhibitions. Turkey's ammunition production lines are supported by a sophisticated and high-tech defense industrial infrastructure. Modern factories are equipped with automated production equipment and advanced quality control systems, enabling the production of ammunition in large quantities with a high degree of consistency and reliability. Turkey has succeeded in diversifying its products in the ammunition production line. From small ammunition for small arms to large ammunition for artillery and warship armament, Turkey has developed a broad product portfolio to meet a wide range of military needs. Bloomberg recently released news about the U.S. being in talks to increase purchases of explosives from Turkey in order to increase production of artillery shells to send much-needed ammunition to Ukraine. Turkey's supplies of trinitrotoluene, known as TNT, and nitroguanidine, used as a propellant, will be crucial in the production of NATO standard 155mm caliber ammunition. Turkey is already on track to become the largest seller of artillery shells to the U.S. by the start of this year. The surge in demand has led to a backlog in global orders and put pressure on defense supply chains, particularly on components such as TNT. President Recep Tayyip Erdogan plans to visit the White House on May 9th for the first time since President Joe Biden took office as the two smooth military ties. Turkey's approval of Sweden's NATO membership this year paved the way for Washington to sign off on the billion-dollar sale of American-made F-16 fighter planes, missiles, and bombs to Ankara. The production line of Turkish defense company Repcon is expected to produce around 30% of all 155mm artillery shells. Additionally, the Defense Department purchased 116,000 rounds of combat-ready ammunition from Turkey's Arca Defense for delivery this year, and further purchases are expected to be delivered as soon as next year, the source added. The U.S. and European efforts are part of a race to catch up with Moscow, which puts it in position to produce by some estimates 4 million rounds this year, including shipments from North Korea. In contrast, the European Union estimates it will triple production of artillery shells this year to around 1.4 million units. With continuously improving product quality and relatively low production costs, Turkey has been able to enter the global market with its ammunition products. Successfully built a strong supply chain for the ammunition industry, with vertical integration allowing greater control over production costs. Aggressive marketing strategies and a wide distribution network have helped Turkey to expand its market share worldwide.
In addition, Turkey's participation in international trade fairs and strategic partnerships with companies abroad have helped increase its visibility in the global market. With the continued increase in demand for affordable, high-quality ammunition, Turkey has the potential to continue to grow and develop in the global ammunition industry. With a commitment to innovation, quality, and efficiency, Turkey can play a significant role in meeting security and defense needs around the world. This allows Turkish companies to offer competitive prices to customers in the global market. The country has established partnerships with various countries and international companies to market and sell its ammunition throughout the world. Turkey's ammunition production lines are an integral part of the country's rapidly growing defense industry. With modern infrastructure, advanced technology, product diversification, continuous innovation, and global market expansion. Turkey has proven itself to be at the forefront of the global munitions industry and is an example for other countries looking to develop their own defense manufacturing capabilities.